love, baby. What's up, G Love? See, y'all about to get the real, real. See, you know, I feel like. Oh, you don't, don't get the dishes, they dirty. No, it's uh, keep it appear with them. It's seven o'clock. It's seven o'clock on the dot. I am exhausted. I feel <laughs> like. I could literally close my eyes right now and just go to sleep. But well, we went on a nice little walk today. You know, we went and got some food. And um, now we're back at the crib. And as y'all can see, it is nighttime. Christmas trees lit up and everything like that. Y'all, my honey was so oh. sweet. We were laying in the bed all day today. And he was like, you know what? Get up, get dressed. We're going to go to the park. So he took me to this park that I had never been to. And it was really nice. It was uh, downtown. And we just walked the park together, holding hands. We watched the sunset, so this is fun. So that was our day today. Y'all know it's vlogmas. We shooting everything every day, and, and we're literally shooting it tonight. And y'all getting in the morning. I have no idea. And sometimes Jazz be up editing. Sometimes till two, three in the morning. Lately, this past month, yeah, I've been up editing till three in the morning. That's why I'm so tired because I literally have not slept this entire month. Because what we do is we shoot the video, <laughs> and then we usually shoot the video at night. So by like, I'd say maybe nine-ish or something, I'm editing. But in between, I'm not editing straight. We'll be watching a movie or he'll be telling me a story. So it's not like- He's telling me a story. And his stories last for hours. It ain't no quick story. <laughs> so it's not a consistent thing of editing. So I'll be up till like two, three in the morning every day, making sure y'all get these videos the next morning. Give my baby some kudos and some big credit. Give her a round of applause in the comment section. All right. Y'all see this towel? I'm about to throw it in! <laughs> we have an update video for you guys, and we're actually kind of excited. All right, so we have our shot glasses. Jamaica, Jamaica, Jamaica. What is Jamaica sweater? Cue the Jamaican music. And cut. We ain't did that one in a while. I know. You really just G, G Love. You remember that. But so one thing about us, we do, uh, when I go, or when we both go different places, we get shot glasses. So one is from St. Lucia and one is from Jamaica. Let's get the spiked eggnog first. Okay. So we have some eggnog, right? I'm not a big eggnog drinker. Boom. Well, we had this with Jazz's parents. Her mom and dad was in town and we obviously drank some. We all kind of tested it out and tried it out. You know, um, this wasn't like our first time obviously drinking it. So we just gonna drink some shots of eggnog and we're gonna give y'all the update that we got with our dog because if you know you've been watching every last video and you big g love then you know that we were talking about getting a dog a long time ago if you watched the video we posted oh it was some months ago we were talking about getting the dog and we wanted to get a doberman a connie corso or neapolitan massive neapolitan massive uh, uh a kango y'all know what a kango is oh. Remember the one that's the, the, the big furry one? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. A Kango. We were already considering a Kango, but she didn't want, I want one, but she she's not part of Kangos. Yeah. But I say Kango, Neapolitan Massive, Doberman Pinscher, uh, Kane Corso, Rottweiler. Oh, yeah, we did. Rottweiler. Rottweiler, yeah. I grew up with Rottweiler. Yeah, so we're giving you guys this update video because we finally found a breeder out mm -hmm. here that we actually really, really like. Yep. What are we going to name one, though? I don't know. That would be a good question, G Love. We might let G Love name them. That would be kind of That would be legendary, right? We think we're pretty certain on one, but we're going, we'll probably go out there, I want to say within the next two weeks. To our dog. To our dog. There we go, baby. Good job. <laughs> baby, that shit actually good. I ain't going to lie to you. That's good. That is good. Okay, I'm going to pull me up another one. No, 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 I don't no, want no, yours. I don't want yours. We're gonna give y'all another update on the house. Okay, you give them all of it, huh? I'm gonna give y'all an update on we're gonna give y'all updates on everything. Okay. So our dog, we have our dog uh coming soon. And also I know when we did talk about the dog last time, they were like, Oh, well you're in an apartment, you don't need a dog. But we're actually not gonna be here. Here's what I'll say. I'll say a lot of y'all don't know what y'all talking about if you're talking about having a dog in an apartment. You can have big dogs in apartments, it's not about the dog's confinements and where they're living. And you know we I mean? have like, our square footage here is like 2,000 square foot. We yeah. have a large apartment. And we got a whole dog park downstairs. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> it's like, it's crazy. But the thing is though, it's, it's not even about that. that. That matters 
for people that's not going to do stuff with their dog. They're not going to take their dogs on, you know, a sport training or dog parks or hiking or doing a lot of activities with your dog, taking their dogs to the ocean, to the lake. And you know what I'm saying? Just, I don't know if you want to bring your dog to the ocean here. Have my swimming out there, shark come up, grab it. We're going to be doing so much with our dogs right. that... You got to be active with your dogs. Yeah. All the dog is literally doing here is sleeping here and chilling here when you're chilling here. Yeah. So I think a lot of dogs, I think that's people thought that false narrative that a big dog can't be in an apartment. That makes zero sense. So I don't, <laughs> I don't agree with that. Like you must never have a big dog in an apartment. And if you got a big dog in an apartment, you must not ever take your dog out to do anything. Do you do any activities? Do you take them on walks? You know what I mean? You got to burn out their energy, go out, have a lot of fun with them, do activities with them, all depending on the temperament of the dog breed and what that dog breed requires. Right. You and also, I mean? we have a park downstairs, so you can easily just go downstairs and take the dog so to the park. whole two dog parks down there. Yeah, so, so it's more yeah. than enough for a big dog to, to be here. But needless to say, uh, we're, we're getting a dog, which you guys will find out very, very soon what It should it be is. like at least, like minimum, like, couple weeks and uh with the house we're also like we said looking into a house yeah. and, and, and we gonna keep it all real with y'all too we were gonna vlog it but we already looked at a house we already went to a house checked it out we had our uh real estate uh what do you call them do realtor realtor yeah, real estate. i forgot <laughs> we had our realtor you know what i mean up there and uh we went and looked at a house it was good nice little satchel good price it had like what six bedrooms it was, yeah, it was like six bedrooms, had a pool, all mm -hmm. of that. Yeah, it was nice. Hot tub. Yeah. Yeah, good. It was a nice size. So how many square foot was the house? Sure. Five thousand. Square feet? Yeah. Okay, I knew it had so, about five or six. But yes, we are looking there. So that's the update with the house. It's an update with, we already gave you guys the updates with the wedding. There's always You need to take update. your eggnog shot. It's the Christmas spirit. This is Vlogmas, what, 15? 16? 15. 15. We're halfway there. Come on. I'm tired. Oh my God. Y'all gonna think we alcoholics or something. Easy. I'm telling you, smooth. Tell me they smooth. You don't even need no chaser. I feel like the past few videos, we just been drinking and hey, drinking and drinking. So y'all wanna know why we put the eggnog in this video? And I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. It's because it makes it a little bit more exciting on the thumbnail and stuff like that. And it's Christmas time. It's eggnog. It's vlogmas number 15. And we're giving y'all an update. You know what I mean? It was always supposed to be the updated dog. She gave y'all a little extra. Yeah, I know a few people have asked, like, are y'all still getting a dog? What's going on with that? Yes, we're still getting a dog. Listen, here's the thing. It's all about finding a dog that temperament fits yours and your temperament fits the dog. <laughs> That's how you're gonna have the best success rate at finding the, you know, your best partner to, you know, add to the addition to the family. So I think the Neapolitan Mastiff is more our temperament. It can go out and do stuff, but it doesn't require it or demand it. There's gonna be so many people Googling what that is because y'all, I didn't even know what it was. Neapolitan Massive, top level dog. Don't get the droopiness messed up. It's a good secure dog. Is it, you know, a top level guard dog? It's one of, it's one of them ones, like it is. Y'all comment below, let us know. Which one would you pick? Doberman, Neapolitan Massive, or Kanye Corso? And now, mind you, keep in mind our temperament too, because y'all want their temperament to match our temperament. Mm -hmm. You don't want a dog that's super active and we gotta go hiking in the Mount Everest and go out there and be out there uh, in the mountains and you know, every second of every day. Oh. We want a dog that's calm, mm -hmm. has good guard dog purposes, and the temperament is nice and mellow and cool. And this is an update that we want to talk about, mm -hmm. but we just couldn't find a way to tie it into the other Vlogmas videos that we got coming in the future. And we couldn't find a way to tie in this update in the videos that we've already done for this Vlogmas for the first half of the, uh, first half of the Vlogmas month. So we want to give you an update video and at the same time it takes a little break off my baby because she be up editing in the morning till 2-3 o'clock in the morning. You know what I mean? And uh, yeah, y'all get the so video at 8.30. 8 right I feel like my energy is like, I'm so tired. But that's the update. We wanted to give that to y'all because we just uh, got the news today about the dog. So we figured, what the heck, let's give y'all an update. You got Since, it this morning technically, so yeah, yeah, you're right. This morning. So that is the update with the dog. We got to figure out some names. I want a real clever name. We also gonna start them like a YouTube, not a YouTube, but Instagram page. Yeah, she did say that. All right, G-Loves. Well, that is it for this video. We will catch you guys tomorrow in the next video. You want some more eggnog? No. Okay. I'm about to get some sleep, y'all. It has been real. We'll catch y'all in the next video. See ya.